my um, mother-in-law, my suegra, Diego's grandma, Dominic's grandma, had surgery, and so our family has been focused on that. But the workers have still been very hard at work at our house. So the boys and I, Fidel's actually at the hospital with his mom. So the boys and I came out here today to give you guys an update on what they've done. We wanted to also show you the crops, and then what else are we doing? We're gonna go get some cleaning. We're gonna go get some capolines. Now, if you like what you're watching, don't forget to hit the thumbs up button. And subscribe. And subscribe. Enjoy, guys. Boys have opted to get capolines first, so that's where we're headed. <laughs> oh, that was a stick. <laughs> Look at all these ones on the ground that are wasted. All right. That's from him. Can you reach any of them? Yeah. Okay, I'm in charge well, of holding that. Right, we're sending brother up. There goes brother. He's got to climb up because we don't want Fidel here. <laughs> Be careful. I like your mismatched socks today. Nobody would have ever known, too, if you want to climb the tree. <laughs> you get some? All right. To a different part so we can find more. Moss. Moss. These are almost all dried up so it's not gonna be too long before this tree doesn't have any more capulines in it. All right guys we didn't get as many as we do when Fidel's here and the tree's almost out but we got some so that's okay. We're gonna go back and give you guys a house update and then an update on Fidel's crops. So look at our house from the front big these are already. Man, they're pretty. My boys. <laughs> All right, coming in through the garage. There's Diego. Boys are also going to get their haircuts today. Haircut today. <laughs> Diego's really excited. Mm -hmm. We've got buckets of cement because today they are filling in castillos. Take us back and show us. Should we go into your room? Hurry, let's go this way into your room. That's the office, this way. Here's Dominic's room. They do have all the castillos up except for the corner one and the closet one. But that's because they were working on these back walls. Here's the bathroom, but all the walls are up in the bathroom and all of the castillos are also filled in. A little hard to envision it without all of the castillos filled in on this part. But in this hallway, we did put in two storage closets, which is right here and right over here. And those are on either side of the entrance for the um, bathroom on the first floor. So they have uh, the walls all built up for these. And next, they'll just be filling in these inside castillos. But before they do that, they're filling in all of the outside um, the outside wall Castillos first. Here's a look at my office. Now they have completed the walls for my office and they are now filling in these Castillos. Like I said, they're filling in the outside um, wall Castillos first before they focus on the ones that are on the inside. That's just the order that they're doing it in. Now they haven't had Fidel here all week and probably won't have him most of next week. And so these guys have just been working really hard without him, which is really, really nice. Um, because we're still making progress on the house while we get to focus on my suegra. Hola, buenas tardes. Este, estamos aquí volando las demás columnas. No está el patrón por casos de salud de paredes de su mamá. Pero por lo menos seguimos aquí en chamba. Ya vamos colando las cadenas, eh, los castillos, perdón. Ya colamos unos allá de aquel lado y ahí vamos cerrando poco a poco. Poco a Nos poco. Nos faltan más, pero ya vamos arrimando más. Más a la vez. <laughs> and they're also filling in, as you guys can see this Castillo, I didn't get it earlier, but they've got this one going on as well. And it looks like Dominic has found their Coca-Cola. ¿Qué es eso? Sí, pero este, este, este Coca de sus tíos. ¿Quiere poquito? Vamos a buscar una, una vaso. Let's go find a glass. Let's go find a cup. Can you take it or do you want mommy to carry it? Do you got it? Be really careful. You're good, you're good. Just be careful. 
We gotta find a cup. A cup. <laughs> yeah? Okay, step down and let's go find you a cup. <laughs> Found a cup. <laughs> Is that good, Coca? Watch out, watch out, watch out. Your deal. Watch out. <laughs> Let your deal pass. Good job, buddy. Tiny boss. Well, maybe without it all, but the tiny boss is here. <laughs> We're mixing cement. Listen, I was going to take you guys back here to show you all of Fidel's crops and the progress, but the guys told me that earlier this week they found another rattlesnake and they're known to be out during the day. And because I have the kids here, well, and because I don't want to get bit either, we're not going to go back there. But as you can see, Fidel's broccoli is getting really, really big. This is his broccoli. Here are his tomatillos. He does have two rows of onions and then some more tomatillos. So all the crops are doing really well. And we also have people helping to take care of them while Fidel and I are focusing on his mom. Dominic trying to get more soda. But I also, in the last home update, told you guys that they had this belt and another um, level of the cinder box to do on the front of the house. They have since completed that with the exception of one block right there <laughs> and the front door. But now you can get an idea of the windows for the front of the house. So we have a window for the dining room. We do have a window um, that is partially in the dining room and then partially in front of the stairs. We have the front door, another window that looks into the entryway and the living room, and then the two completed windows for my office. And Dominic wants to swing in his swing, so we're gonna make sure that he gets a swing in his swing before we head to town to get some groceries and the boys' haircut. And brother's helping out with the swinging part <laughs> so that I can film. Dominic loves the swing. No sick guy. No sick guy. Don't fall. I thought I would ask Diego a couple of common questions that I see about him or you guys asking about him while um, we're here doing this update. So, all right, Diego, first things first, do you like living in Mexico? Yes. <laughs> What's your favorite part about living in Mexico? Campo. The campo. Uh -huh. So out here More in all of this. To play with them. That's a good one. That's a good one. What do you, what do you think you miss the most from the U.S.? Family. Jesus, how sour about Sour Patch Kids? Ooh, Sour Patch Kids. How about Taco Bell? You miss Taco Bell? Yeah. <laughs> we cannot get Taco Bell here. We get awesome tacos here. Oh, I always say KFC, but we can get KFC here. We can get KFC here. What's your favorite food here? KFC. KFC? No, what's your favorite traditional food here? Uh, tacos or burritos. Tacos or burritos. What is your favorite holiday living in Mexico? Dia de los Muertos. Yeah, that's a yeah. good one, right? Yeah, that's a good holiday. They have the best bread. They, <laughs> they do have the best pan on Dia de los Muertos. <laughs> it's, the only, it's the only time of the year you can get that pan. And it's really good. Uh, yeah, the, oh, the pan that looks like the bones. Uh-huh, pan de muerto. Yeah, look at you. Diego, do you remember how old you were when, you moved to, when we moved to Mexico? Around six, seven. Yep, oh, he was, seven. yeah, you were, I think maybe three days before your seventh birthday yeah. is when we moved here. Now was at school. Yep. Yeah, crazy, crazy times. What do you think you'll do in the future? Go to college, get a part-time job, and if I, I'm thinking about it, probably move down here and get, and work online. Nice. So you want to live in Mexico after college? Well, I'm thinking about it. Well, you'll have this big giant house to live in with your brother. Well, in the future, I might change my mind. So. That's true. Any, anything can change. You could also go to a whole different country. If you could go to any country in the world, where would you go? Hmm. Yeah, I haven't really thought about it. Um, but 
probably Africa. Oh, you would go to Africa? Is that so you could see elephants? Because I would love to go see elephants. Mom, your exception with <laughs> your love for your elephants. I am obsessed with elephants in case you guys didn't know that. Awesome. Thank you, Diego. So that is the house update. Like I said, the workers have been really working really, really hard. They're also um, helping with Fidel's fields so that um, the fields are taken care of. There's not much to do there now except for let the plants grow. Um, but we're going to head out and we are going to get the boys' haircut. I'm going to try and get you some footage of that. If, if I did get you footage, awesome. If I didn't, I'm really sorry because I am by myself today. Um, and then we're going to go get some groceries and... Uh, and then head home and probably find a movie to rent tonight. So um, since it's just the boys and I, but we hope everybody has a great weekend. We appreciate your patience as we focused on um, the boys' grandma, my mother-in-law, Fidel's mother, and um, we'll hopefully be back posting more videos very, very soon. But until then, we hope everybody has a great day. And as always, thank you so much for being here. Bye guys. Say bye. Bye. Say bye. Bye! You're so high!